There we go. Substitution at the half for Rayados and Monterrey. Number 15, Hector Moreno, is replaced by number 20, Sebastián Vegas. All right, we're live. Second half. See if we can continue for as long as we can. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. People are starting to pop, pop in. If you're watching, chat. What size, size shoe am I, One World? I am a size 10. You guys, were, some people were asking what I was gonna eat at halftime. That's what I was gonna eat. There was like some uh, beef that was really good, some roasted potatoes. Oh. oh, that was lamb? It was lamb that I had. That was lamb. It was really good. And some sort of like shrimp crostini thing that was good, nice and tasty. Still trying to eat it. They didn't give me enough time for halftime. Oh, here we go, here we go. Here we go, here we go. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, 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 oh. Ah. here guys lamb as you guys start filing in uh, get active let's talk let's chat That lamb was good. I didn't know it was lamb. It was good. So normally I wouldn't get that kind of food. Normally, you know, you've seen us eating burgers and things like that here. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, you should. Because we might do this again. Sorry, I'm burping. My food. Yeah, if you want to see even more of the food, the first live I did in the beginning, I was showing some of it. And I think Ed will show some of it too in the uh, vlog. They have like over here in the load section, they got sushi, they've got ice cream, hot dogs, of course. They've got lamb. It's some sort of fish. The second half is feeling like it's going to be more like the first where Monterey has most of the ball. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh! All right, Aviles, nice, uh, nice slack. The vlog will be in English, Sports Shorts. But that's a valid question, because Ed's doing it. It could go either way, but he he's doing it in English. Concern again, another Inter-Miami player down. Hey, Richard Greenberg up from Toronto. How's Toronto doing? Toronto's doing better this year, aren't they? Do they say like, do they say like next steps? Like, I'm a Dimento! 
Who's that? Who is that? Is that Wing It? No, I got one. Thank you. Yeah, that's Wing It. Hey, Ed, can you play if, uh, if they need you? Oh, he's already gone. I mean, we get so many injuries, we might need to uh, start looking at the fans for... Uh, Yeah, as far as those shoes, though, one more one goal. <clears throat> the ones that were Patrick was showing, I like them. The fact that they're leather and they're maybe black and or pink, depending on which way you go, I like that. But it didn't have the herons. It's a you know logo on it, which I prefer with the uh, the other Sambas, the original ones that had the heron on it. You know, they're Inter Miami branded versus the new ones seem to be Messi branded. But, I mean, I'm not an anti messy brand, but, you know, I'm pro team, pro club. I'd rather have it with uh, club. Come on, come on! Wow! Wow, how did that not go in? How did that not go in? I'm not buying from eBay. That's the thing. I don't want to buy from eBay. I don't want to spend the exorbitant prices. It's not worth it. It's not worth that much. Look, I held off on buying the other ones. I'm uh, I'm not gonna pay extra. Six and a half men's, or eight and a half girls, is that what you're saying? We need a size 10, size 10, size 10 men's. I can't remember the last time I owned a pair of Adidas. Like, I, I, the, my game day shoes, I showed them for a second in the other video. My game day shoes are these, but they're, they're Nike. Because that's what my wife bought me. And then I just, I put my own laces on it. But the wife, uh, you know, I, I, I was kind of, at the time, like, hey, it should have been Adidas. The team wears Adidas. But, you know, that's what she found. I can't remember the last time I had a pair of Adidas. Because uh, the wife buys me Nike a lot because she likes Nike. And generally, I'm okay with whatever she gets. The pink laces, One World, I got them on Amazon. I got a, I, it came with two pair, two two pairs of um, of laces. I got a second pair. Yeah, I like the Adidas too, but like I said, my wife is more of a uh, Nike Nike girl. My wife likes to buy a lot of the uh, workout shoes. Ah, he was looking to make that run. He wanted a card there. Richard Greenberg wears the class, classic Adidas Stan Smith. I like those. I like those. The last pair of shoes I bought were a pair of On Clouds. And they were specifically purchased for Disney. They're like uh, theme park shoes. They're just, uh, you know, good running shoes or whatever, but they... I felt like they might be good theme park shoes. Good job, North Carolina. What did North Carolina do? Something to do with college basketball, maybe? I don't know. This is a spot where we need Messi. 
This is a messy spot right here. Yeah, we need, we cannot let them score. Yes, from the schedule break. You know what kind of break. Got some food, made some room for some more beer. Yeah. That's the problem with having some of these older players. You know that they're gonna miss games. This is a game we were all expecting Messi to be back for. Almost. Almost. Got some subs coming in here. Two subs coming in for uh, Monterey. This is, I think, their third. They made one at halftime as well, so this would be their third sub. Two subs coming in. We got Tata and Alba having a conversation. Forget the World Cup, Messi. Forget the World Cup. Let's just uh, win the uh, CONCACAF Cup. Oh, damn, he's open. Woo! Yes, Esteban Dito, this is live. We are live right now. It is 1-0 in the 58th minute. That was Afonso that did that? Yeah. Ah. It's hard to tell sometimes on the small screen. Yes, I agree with you, Krabs. Focus on Miami. But he's not. So uh, FS1's uh, about, a, what, a, a minute, minute and a half behind. I guess they have to, though, for, for uh, in case somebody curses or any, you know, stuff like that, they got to be able to, to block it out. So it makes sense that there's a bit of a delay. Not, not bad at all, huh? Kick your feet up, front row. Ed, do you want to switch? Down here. Like two minutes behind, all right. Our Monterey fan is getting upset. He's not happy with his players right now. Hundred and sixty-two in pink, one forty-eight in black. All right, thanks, One World, doing the shopping for me. Now I got to convince my wife to let me buy him. Then again. My birthday is coming up in a couple months. Maybe uh, maybe that's a birthday present, right? Esteban asking, how come I'm live, but I don't do it for MLS games? Because I don't have these seats normally for MLS games. And uh, I didn't plan on doing this. I just kind of didn't put the phone down. I uh, Normally, you know, we're sitting over here. Normally we're wait we're up here, right around there. And you know, it's uh the zoom and everything. Here I don't really have to zoom. I mean this this look, these are my seats. These are my seats right here. These are amazing seats. So uh that's why. And also I generally think you guys would rather watch these games on TV. You know, uh, my shaky camera, you know, it's it's okay, but I always figure you'd rather watch a TV broadcast. Yeah, Esteban, I'm a high roller. Esteban, where have you been? 
I haven't seen you on any of our Sunday night shows. I thought you uh, you left us feeling a little hurt. Uh-oh. A lot of people would appreciate that. Okay, yeah. Nice seats, Richard. Those are good seats. You should do this, Richard. You should do this kind of thing at the TFC games. Those are good seats. So, Richard, if I come up to Toronto, can I sit there? I am hurt, Esteban. I, ha I do have feelings. I do, really. It may be hard to believe, but I really do. I don't see you in the live chat on Sunday uh, evenings. I shed a little tear. Just a little tear. Not a big tear, but a little tear. Esteban, do you still have uh, season tickets? I haven't seen you at the stadium either. Decent spot here for Monterey. All right. Thanks, Richard. Of course, I asked that with, you know, I don't know if I'll ever end up in Toronto, but it'd be a cool place to visit. I hear it's beautiful. Yeah, keep playing like that, Monterey. Keep playing like that. I could try to do this, to your point, Esteban, I could try to do this from my seats. It just would be a much more zoomed out shot. And when I zoomed in, it'd be way shakier because you know how it is when you zoom in on your phones. But I could try. Wow, why don't you, hey, uh, Richard, why don't you want to go to the uh, inner mining game? Is that just because, wait. Froze, I'm sorry. Monterey fans not happy. Yeah, I get that, Richard. I get that. For sure, I get that. Crabs, I wish he would prioritize Intermini over Copa America, but you're right. Is the football game full or is it Monterey playing? It's a full, it's a pretty good crowd. Got the Monterey fans right over the corner. Uh-oh, we got some Monterey fans behind me getting loud. No, no Messi. Ooh. Messi's here. He's in street clothes. Here, I'll show you where Messi is. Messi's over here. Right there. He's getting up. See him reaching? There he is. There's Messi. Reaching for something. Looking around, pointing things out. Uh, stadium percentage. I'd say it's like 90% full. Hey, Batty, if you get the comment match, you will do a lot of money. I don't know what that means. Yeah, yeah, these are amazing seats. I've gotten to sit here a few times. Um, Uncle Ned got to sit here once. Yeah, the men... The, uh, the Monterey fans are loud. The Monterey, fan Monterey fans are louder. The Monterey fans are louder than Inner Miami fans. Six 
65th minute. 65th minute. Hey, Tata! Tata! Ugh, hang on. Pull, hang on, I'm trying to read something. Pone is Jago por favor. I don't know what that means. Something about. Over where? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Show the Monterey fans right there. Uh, sorry for the movement. I had to drink my beer. That's what's uh, trying to do a live while you're trying to enjoy a beverage, you know, finish any of them. Yeah, the, the Monterey fans do. I mean, look, the, the Miami fans are loud. They are um, drumming. Ed, what would you say the stadium is? 90% full? Uh oh! Number 73. Sailor's Sailor coming in. Alonso. Whoa! Entering the game, number 15, Ryan Sailor. So, the uh, substitute is coming out. It, it must have been that injury. Or is that tactical? Is that tactical because we need defense? Because Sailor's coming in, bringing in Sailor. Sailor's a tall defender. So is Afonso hurt, or is that? Oh. Thank you, Calendar. I agree, Esteban. It is impressive that Messi, uh, that we're winning without Messi. He's big. He's tall. He's a motherfucker. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. I don't know how that's going to work with, uh, with my monetization. Thanks everybody for joining. If, if, if you're here, look, I only see 27 likes. If you're watching this, you you owe me a like. You owe me a thumbs up. I don't know, something about... The Capana. What's that? Those away goals, baby. They don't got none yet. They they better not get any away goals. Somebody was asking by Capana. I think he, I see him warming up over there. guys watching online, uh, I'm curious, was that a known goal or what was the deal? They showed a replay, but I missed it. Yep, they got the away goal. Away goals count more in case of a tie. Sucks. All right, so let's be real. We need like two more goals now. If we go to Mexico as a... No? All right.
So Sports Shorts thinks it should be an own goal, but I'm hearing from my replay guy in the back that uh, not an own goal, but close. Oh, oh, VAR, VAR. It was an own goal, he said. Esteban, the Roy goals don't count as double, but they do matter with, um, with, uh, with if there's a tie. So there he is watching. He's watching the um, the VAR. So anybody that was wondering if the VAR is happening, it's happening. It's happening right there. You got the referee right over there. Well, did you guys realize that we got a red card? Oh, that was red. I didn't realize we got a red card. I'm being told. I thought they said red card, but I, but I assumed it was yellow. Rui's got a red card. Is that why they had to make that shift? I guess. Yeah, that's probably why the shift. Thanks, everybody in the chat. I missed it. I heard red card, but I was like, I saw a yellow. Oh, here we go. Oh! So the goal is going to count. Good score by number 11, Maximiliano Mesa from the Jones of the Rey, 69 minutes. Clear goal. Yeah, it's hard to tell when you're here live, especially also I'm looking at this through a phone screen. So I didn't, I, I missed some of that. I'm going to, I'm going to rewatch this game back at home for sure. So we're playing with 10 men. Don't go, Caesar. Don't go. Why not? The away goal, uh, Esteban, will help Monterey. So I know we were debating that away goals do matter. They don't count as double. But in the, in the case of a tie, if, for example, we, uh, at the end of the two games, if we're even, then the away goals uh, count more. Well, they're, they're, the away goals are the tiebreaker. The guy's a nice guy. I'm not. <laughs> you guys are giving him a hard time. He's a nice guy. We were talking to him at halftime. He's just a fan. Yes. Oh, almost. I agree with you, Crabs, of all the times. Cambialo, cambialo, cambialo. I appreciate all of you guys that are watching. It's fun. And for those of you that uh, don't have Fox Soccer or, or Tuda Andy, this is a chance to watch it. Yeah, you're probably right, Esteban. Oh, come on. Jet's got a yellow. Pretty sure that yellow is for uh, for talking. Yeah. 
middle guard for Ethan Miami City which gets number five. 76 minutes. I gotta watch that back one world. I, I, I didn't see exactly what Ruiz did to earn the red. He'll be okay. He's, he's growing as a player. Esteban, you, uh, few people will buy CC tickets and Lee's Cup. Um, I think people will buy if they think Messi's going to play. I think, all in all honesty, that's probably the deal. Ed was saying, Ed's saying that, give that guy Taco. Ed is saying that it's 17,000 and change in attendance. We got lucky there. So our Monterey fan back there is saying that the Monterey game, 53,000 people, it's already sold out for the next week's game. Bad touch by Avales. We need to get a little possession. Oh, so what we're hearing, I'm listening to the conversation behind me. In Monterey. Season ticket holders are getting the Champions Cup game as part of their season ticket package, whereas we had to pay extra. You're going to hear some of this in his uh, Basically, things that I'm repeating to you, or you're going to hear some of it in Ed's vlog, because uh, I'm getting my information from him. No, the away goals are not worth two, Lester. Not exactly. I'm looking forward to watching that one world. I, I, you know, I'm just curious, out of curiosity. You're right, Esteban, milking the, milking the fans, the Moss brothers and Beckham milking the fans. That is true. My biggest complaint is is that uh, as prices go up, service goes down. Even in this section, this is a very expensive seat I'm sitting in, guys. And things have gone down. Oh, yeah, he is very passionate. But just to give you an idea, these seats, normally you have Access, in the past, you had access to the midfield club, and you also had access to the uh, Northwest Club. Uh, you only have access to the midfield club. They've removed the Northwest Club access, and these are way more expensive tickets. You should have access to everything. Got some Monterey fans in here, it looks like. Glad to see you guys here. We're hoping that you lose, but I'm glad you're here. Lalo, stop complaining.
Yeah, Lalo, give me a thumbs up. If you're going to complain, give me a thumbs up. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. Let's go. I agree with William. Let's go, Miami. Next Wednesday, I think. But U.S. teams don't do well in Mexico. Altitude, travel. And, and their fans will throw stuff on the field and berate you. And they're, they're rough. They're rough fans. They're, they're good, but, you know, they're, they're rough. U.S. teams just don't have a good track record in uh, Mexico. Give him a red, give him a red. All right, well, at least you got a yellow. Got a yellow, because uh, Suarez yelled at him. <laughs> Monterey coaches are not happy. Oh, Gerardo is uh, making his claim that Club America is going to win it all. So you're saying Club America could beat Monterey, is that what you're saying? Yeah, a lot of yellows, you're right. Agree, Krabs, even if Messi comes back. Another substitute happening here. Grant, Grant of Aska is coming out. FC Cincinnati player. Yeah, I agree, William, that this ML, uh, the um, salary cap definitely hurts. Ruiz can't play, but Campana can play. Come on. Cannot let them score again. Trying to read. I'm trying to follow comments and watch the game. Sometimes I'm looking at the phone, sometimes I'm looking at the field. Yeah, Tata needs to make some changes. We got all of our substitutes are up. They're all. All the substitutes are up over here. But nobody is ready to come in. Score is 1-1, one, one, Lou. Jordi, ahí va. Vete para España. 
We got what about five minutes left before stoppage time. I don't understand the fact that we haven't made substitutions other than, you know, red card substitutions, injury substitutions. We haven't made anything when we needed an attack. Sailor did well there. People like to hate on Sailor. You're welcome, Hobbit. Oh! Oh, come on! Come on! Oh, come on! Tata trying to get his uh, assistant under control. Yeah, that's what the, our chat is saying, handball as well. You're welcome, Joyce. Those, these are amazing seats. These are not my normal seats, so this is a rare treat that we'll be doing this. We have a good friend that hooks us up once in a while. Thanks everybody that's watching. 900 people, but only 85 likes. Oh, Tata, you don't like Tata, huh, Ademar? VAR ref! Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Oh, damn, oh, damn, oh, no! Dead. That's it. This hole may be too big. I, I mean, look, two to one, this is it, I think, I mean, look, this, uh, this, this tournament may be over for Miami right here, right now. I mean, we'll be rooting for a comeback, we'll be rooting for them, but, um, not looking good. If you were to put money, because I, I saw Richard talking about putting money, if you were to put money come on, come on. on this on the next round on, on Inter Miami going forward, you probably have to put money on Monterey. Look, they're loud right now. Feels like we're in uh, Mexico here. They're, they're chatting, they're chatting.
¡Acábalo! 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 Monterrey. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Why is Campana not in this game? Agreed, Hobbit. We definitely need Messi. I was very let down when uh, I saw that Messi was not playing. They always like to diminish the injury, saying it's nothing much, but he's missed a lot at this point. This was the game we were all banking on Messi. And he wasn't ready. Campana is standing in the corner. Tata is not feeling like he uh, needs to make any subs. I know Tata gets a lot of hate. Lesnar, yeah, hopefully, hopefully uh, Messi does play in Mexico. We need him. Tata gets a lot of hate, and uh, some of it's deserved. His substitutions, and and we know he could also be very bullheaded, you know, and in, 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 in wanting to force a formation. I mean, he was trying to force the three-man back in the past. That guy's having fun. The guy's having fun. And and, and he should have fun. It, you know, he deserves to have a little fun. Agreed. We need to win 2 nothing Or 3-1, right? I mean, it's definitely an uphill battle for Inter-Miami as they travel to uh, Mexico. Do they need to start turning their attention to MLS Cup? <laughs> Sophia, you're funny. Yeah, I have no idea what he's saying. I don't speak Spanish. <laughs> but he's having fun. <laughs> Lester, I don't think that's a strategy to keep Mexi from Mexico. That's it. <laughs> Messi is just hurt. Yeah, that's it, guys. That's it. Rolling out everything.
is that Ed? I don't know if you guys get to hear. I don't know if you. I don't know. I don't know if you. I don't know if. Every, I don't know if everybody could hear you, Ed, because my mic is close to me. But. But Ed is calling for Tata's head. Ed is calling for Tata's head. He is done with Tata, as a lot of you are. Yeah, Ed is pissed off. Ed is pissed off. Angel, you're happy. On hell. What? No, no, no. Uh, Whoa, 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 Alfonso's okay, man. Alfonso's good, but... Alfonso didn't play that long, either. Right. All right, well... What's that? Oh, yeah, here we go. We got uh, Jose Moss. We got Jose Moss right here. One of the owners of the club hanging out here. Taylor, you the man! Taylor uh, is shaking hands with some kids and some people. What's that? He's given. Taylor uh, giving somebody a shirt. Yeah, there he is. Nice suit. I don't know who this guy is, but he's getting an autographed Taylor jersey. So that guy's a famous YouTuber? No, no, but he's had a famous YouTuber in his suite. But the guy with the backwards cap, who is he? Uh, I think he owns uh, some. Uh, rehab centers. Rehab centers? All right. Here we got set up for the media. Here we go, Beckham's uh, son. Here we go, Beckham's uh, uh, son. Posing for some pictures. What's that? Oh, really? Taylor's limping. Uh oh. Well, he did come out for injury. Screw the influencer, Esteban says. Screw the influencers. Oh. <laughs> Mr. Beast was here uh, like a couple games ago, yeah. Yeah, we do have a ton of injuries. And it just keeps getting worse. Is Taylor's now injured? Walking away with a uh, limp? Gorgely, you got an autograph, yeah. Esteban, when are the season ticket holders allowed to take pictures of Messi? Never! <laughs> never! We're never allowed. Messi, you gotta watch on TV when they're showing him in the dugout. Yeah. All right, everybody. Yeah, Jordi Alba's getting interviewed over here.
People yelling for Messi? No, this guy. Is oh. Dude. I'm like, Messi's not here anymore. He's already in his car. We got Brandon Vasquez here, former FC Cincinnati oh, player. I got it. Oh, yeah. Brandon Vasquez sold from FC Cincinnati to uh, Monterey, and he's doing a really good job over in Monterey. Obviously, he knows some of the, uh, you know, MLS people. Where Messi? I mean, Messi's already gone. Brandon Vasquez was carrying a uh, Inner Miami shirt. I'm not sure whose shirt he got. Maybe we'll skip. Yeah, maybe. All right, I think that's about gonna wrap it up. I don't think there's really anything else to show you guys. So, uh, thanks so much for watching. Thanks to everybody that tuned in tonight for both uh, lives. This is different, something new. Maybe we'll try it again in the future. We'll see. Uh, but uh, thanks so much for watching. And uh, make sure to tune in on Sunday night when we do the live. Um, also, tomorrow or the next day, we should have Ed's game day vlog. So, slightly different version of this, shorter. And, uh, and then on Monday, Ed does it, this whole the, uh, vlog, uh, the um, live show in Spanish. So that'll be good. So everybody, thanks very much for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe, and we'll see you later.